CSU has this great vet school. Our program here at the Animal Cancer Center is one of the top cancer centers for animals in the world. We think of it like the Mayo Clinic, really, of cancer treatment for animals. The work that we've done in our lab, and actually my mentors before me, is looking at uh, new techniques for saving the legs of children with bone cancer. And that work was first pioneered in dogs with bone cancer. Currently, most kids that have to have that type of surgery where we're trying to save their legs, they have to have maybe 30 plus surgeries in their lifetime. And we're trying to fix that. And the way that we can do that is by utilizing dogs that have osteosarcoma whose owners choose limb preservation surgery as part of their treatment. Utilizing some of these new therapies that we are discovering in the laboratory, it occurred to us that perhaps we can help both species. The work that was done here at CSU translated directly to changing how kids were treated, um, both from a chemotherapy standpoint as well as from a surgical technique standpoint. Many years ago, 70% of kids with bone cancer died within five years of their diagnosis. And now that statistic is reversed. 70% of kids live more than 10 years. You know, we still have a long way to go. In my mind, it's still not an acceptable statistic that we would lose anybody from bone cancer. It's this great opportunity for me as an investigator, because I am a veterinarian and I went into this field in order to help animals, but I have a great passion for helping kids. And so I get the opportunity to do both. <laughs>